And we're joined now by Jesse Galiff from the Secular Student Alliance and Fox News fame. How are you doing, <laughs> Jesse? Doing well. How are you? Good. So how did... Uh, now, the joke there is that you were on Fox News recently, right? Uh, CNN recently, Fox was a, a while ago, too. Both uh, some interesting questions, fun hosts, and uh, Bill Donahue was on Fox a little while ago with me. Uh, I believe we were promoting the idea that you can be a good person without believing in, a, in God, uh, and he promptly compared us to Jeffrey Dahmer, uh, at which point I started laughing. So, <laughs> Those are fun. Uh, so, well, tell me a little bit about Secular Student Alliance. What is it that you guys do that garnered the comparison to Jeffrey Dahmer? Um, the idea is that we promote and uh, organize student groups for non-religious students on college and high school campuses. Uh, there are so many students who want to perform community service, want to do social events with like-minded peers, want to discuss these ideas without feeling like they're you know, under attack, that uh, they want to know that it's a safe place to talk about these things. And especially in the South, uh, there's a lot of religious pressure. Uh, in the Northeast, people still want to organize and live their values. Uh, and we perform a lot of services, leadership training to help them do these groups and, and really become activists. And if I understand correctly, you guys help the schools to understand how to do this as well, right? Yeah. Uh, a big part of what we can do is helping the administrators understand the importance of the groups. Uh, a lot, especially in high schools. We've done a big push since 2011 to help secular high school students because, let's face it, they need a lot of help. There's a lot more pressure from the administration, uh, from their parents, from their communities. It is actually illegal for administrators to deny students the right to organize a group for secular students, and yet they often do. They say that it's too controversial, that you know, it's not for us. You need to find a sponsor, and then they tell possible sponsors that it would be a bad career move. Uh, so we write letters uh, very politely, telling them that you can't possibly be aware of what's going on because you wouldn't break the law. So just in case you weren't aware, here's the law, here's what's going on, and here's why the students need a group. Uh, and that has so far worked every time. So it's almost gone to litigation a couple times, but the Equal Access Act is entirely on our side, and these schools know it. And just to be clear, you're helping out students who come to you. You're not going and actively recruiting right. students at schools. That's right. Uh, it used to be that we would you know, fly around a campus, see if anybody was interested. Those days are long past. Now uh, students are coming to us faster than ever, faster than we can keep up with, almost. Uh, we had, I think the number was uh, 87 groups in 2007, and now we have 366. Um, it's you know just shot up in that time period. Uh, as the polls find that more and more millennials are doubting the existence of God, more and more millennials are unaffiliated with any religion, and we're turning them into activists. Very good. Now, which TAM is this for you? This is my second TAM. Uh, last year, I got to, to go and had a fantastic time. I really wanted to come back, make sure that uh, my organization sent me as opposed to anybody else. I'm here with a bunch of my coworkers, but uh, it's really important that I came here, see old faces, see, make new friends, uh, see some of these fantastic talks that just, you know, really interesting. Cutting edge science talks about, you know, the unity of mind and identity, um, psychology, and how it fits into the larger picture of the secular and skeptical movement. Great. Now, if people want to find out more about you guys, where do they go? What's the website? Secularstudents.org is the website. We have been experiencing a number of denial of service attacks recently, but uh, we're working on defenses right now. We figure if you've pissed somebody off, then you've done something right. But secularstudents.org will have more information finding the groups, find out what we do for them, and what the students are up to. Thank you very much for joining us, Jesse. Enjoy the rest of TAM. Thank you.